Another Millionaire Midnight Rant, Columbia in edition here. Welcome to the podcast, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, went out tonight with my daughter, but still, the rant is, the rant must happen. Okay. Tonight, once again, we'll do a Q&A. How's everybody doing tonight? Feeling well? Oh my God. Q&A. How's everybody feeling? I love you as well. Thank you for all the love. I do appreciate you guys um, taking a moment out of your your day and your night here to listen to your favorite millionaire here. Feeling great? Feeling good? Did you make money today? Did you make progress today? Did you go through the genie strip today? Hopefully so. So tonight, I'm going to do another Q&A questions. You can post your questions below. I won't hold you long. If you're brand new to the rant, my name is Wesley Billion Dollar Virgin. I am a self-made millionaire from Houston, Texas. I go live every night to share my philosophy on how to become a very wealthy person faster and quicker. Okay. I'm very transparent. I'm unfiltered, but I only speak the truth or my version of the truth. Okay. I love it. All right. So, oh, thank you, Violetta. What's going on, guys? What's up? Let's go. Let's get it. All right, Q&A. Any questions for me? We could talk about business, manifestation, anything that you need to hear or know to get you where you're supposed to be in your life. I'm here for you. (laughs) Don't you love my consistency? I have over 600 plus rants, folks. Isn't that amazing? Over 600 podcast entries you can search for my podcast Wesley Billion Dollar Virgin Podcast here I'm a bit stuffy guys we was out all night partying acting like wild crazy people but we had a good time how to make your money worth more put it in an index fund best way to manifest there's only one way to manifest you have to have an intention And you have to be very clear about what you want. And you have to feel as if you already have what you want to acquire. How do you get over bad habits? Well, you don't need to get over bad habits. You need to replace them with good habits. So whatever the bad habits are, you think about, well, you know, what can I replace these bad habits with? Okay. I want to get ahead of the AI boom. You think it's too it's late? No. It's not too late. And artificial intelligence is a game changer right now in so many different niches and industries here. Hey bro, how do you deal with like AI right now is making me an extra hundred thousand a month, so it's pretty cool. Hey bro, do you feel Do you deal with other people, problems, and weight? Do I deal with their problems? No. Just woke up from from a nap. You taking a nap? What? How dare you take a nap? Work. Let the losers nap. If you're injured for a year, how do you make up for it fast? When you get back on your feet. Well, don't think about how can you make it up fast. Just when you can get back to work or get back to doing what you were currently doing. Just stay focused. Right? (sighs) Excuse me, folks. I have some chicken waiting for me myself. Prepare me a late night snack. So I'm eager to um, have that. 
Wesley, please stay alive for a long time. Well, I don't see any questions below, so if I don't see questions, I'm going to go eat my pollo, my chicken. How do I feel that I already have when the reality tells otherwise? Well, yeah, Ryan, that's the purpose of meditation and visualization. And it takes practice. It takes a while to really get this. But when you begin to imagine that you're the person that you want to be, if you continue to do that, you will become it. Because you think you get what you think about most of the time, folks. So the question is, what are you thinking about? What are we focusing on? What do you mean by that? How did you start? What, internet marketing? How did I start what? How do you beat the high taxes when you want to buy a first-time home? Which high tax are you referring to? Uh, can one someone load the Wasp Edition Columbia rant? Yeah, I think it's I think it was uploaded. You have to check through. Go to the podcast, but it was all uploaded for sure. Oh, okay. Okay, Liz Myren, how are you? Questions for me. Talk to me. Talk to me. Dig me. Talk to me. <laughs> you guys are funny. Hey, Buffy, how are you? Sammy Drex. Talk to me. How are you? I'm doing well. Any questions for me, folks? Um, I'm here for you. Okay. Mm. Hey, Faye. Hey, Hart. How are you? Long, long-term manifesting is easier for me, but emergency manifesting... Well, yeah, it's no such thing as like emergency fund manifestation. Um, I would say, yeah, you don't want to try to manifest when you're in an emergency situation. You have to learn how to continually manifest. And to continually, consistently manifest, you have to be very aware of your thoughts and how you feel about the current thoughts. That's the key. What do you think about the book Millionaire Success Habits? I never read it. What's up, C. Frederick? Frederick, how are you? What's are the best? What's the best way of strategies to sell digital products? Facebook advertisement and TikTok. That's what we're doing. So you hear the bus? When will you do a meditation on your live again? That really helped. Very soon, cats. Very soon, I promise you. Can you share the key milestones and challenges in your entrepreneur journey and that contributed to your success as a millionaire? Sure. Um... I had to realize, one, I didn't know anything. Two, what I was currently doing, I had a passion for it, but other people didn't. What I mean by, like, a lot of you have companies or you're trying to sell different products and services, and you're trying to force it down their throat. But, you know, sometimes the market just doesn't want what you're selling. You have to learn how to pivot, and you got to learn how to pivot quickly. Okay, so I've learned that the hard way. Learn how to pivot. <sighs> and I've learned how to sh- just sell things that people want to buy. Does it make sense? 
And but I'm not gonna lie, Shalika, it was hell. It was tough. But you know, in my thirties, I figured out, I understood the game of wealth, and it's definitely a game for sure. Well, thank you so much, Katie. Mucho gracias. Will you do a rant on goal setting in 2024? Of course. Qatar, how are you? Michelle. Flexing my com complexion, how are you? Hey, Fanny, how are you? Any more questions? I'm doing well. I'm doing very well. Ooh, I want some Chinola juice. Anybody else want some Chinola juice? Wesley, how you feel when I'm a millionaire? I'm going to feel happy for you, man. Thank you for mass control. I'm on day 45. Good job. How many kids do you have? Three. Any more questions for me, folks? Oh. How do you know when making you're making the right decision? Yeah, you never really know. You never know when you're making the right decision. You only know when you make make a decision and you, then you discover that's the wrong decision. But the key is just not to make the right decision. The key is just to make a decision in life, honestly. You can't spend a lot of time hoping that you're making the right decision, right? Just make a decision. If it's not right, then make a new decision, okay? Wesley, do you miss the United States? Absolutely not. I'm a Colombian now. I'm a Colombian part Dominican. A mix. How many times a day do you recommend meditating? At least three. Three times a day. Wesley, what do you think about fake it till you make it? Yeah, do it. It's all good. There's nothing wrong with faking it till you make it. <sighs> oh, my God. Mm. What age group do, do you target when you're doing Facebook ads? 45 plus. 45 plus. You're not Colombian. I am. Yo sé. I mean, um, yo soy. A story. I am Colombian. I'll prove it to you. Um, uno, dos, tres. What would you suggest moving out of states? Would you suggest moving out of the states? It's up to you, man. It's your life. You know, it's totally up to you. But I'll say this, it's such a gorgeous world outside of the States. Better food, better quality of life, better everything, honestly, in some places. What are you meditating on? Nothing currently. How long do you meditate? 26 to 30 minutes at a time. Do you remember your fifth grade teacher? Are you my fifth grade teacher? I do. Her name was Miss Houston. Where is Miss Houston? I miss her. She was amazing. Are you my fifth grade teacher? Who are you? Are you Miss Houston? <laughs> oh, that'd be fun if it was. Well, Miss Houston, you did a great job. I became a millionaire, so you made an impact on my life. <laughs> oh, God. Since following you, I've changed my social circle. 
stop social drinking and drinking. Have set goals. Uh, I'm very proud of you. Good job. What are your target states? No, U.S. Just target the top five. U.S., Canada, um, Europe, U.K., Australia, New Zealand. Have you ever been to England? No. I got a question. What is it? Do you remember when you first made your 500000 a month? Of course I do. Hey, Lala, how are you? Okay. I guess we don't have any questions here tonight. So I just wanted to go live and chime in just to see if you guys... just want you to know I'm always here to support you. I'm always here... Um, if you have any questions about your business, about what you're currently doing, I'm here for you. Just want to be consistent for you here, okay? So, much love, folks. This is Wesley, Billion Dollar Virgin. When did you quit your job? In my early 30s. Hey, Patrick. I quit my job in my early 30s. Any more questions for me? What do you do when you don't know what to do? Yeah, I get it, you know. I would say this. Begin to write down what you want. When you don't know what you want to do, write down what you want. If you don't know, just spend some time, you know, really discovering what that answer is. All right, folks, this is Wesley, Billion Dollar Virgin. Much love. I'll see you tomorrow night. Much love and let's go.